Hey guys, and welcome back to part two of Let's Get to Know Sunset Valley. Um, my other LPs are not going away. Like, there's, st I'm still gonna do them, but for right now, I just wanted to post a Sunset Valley episode. So, yeah. So it turns out I already started to film like half of this, and my mic wasn't properly like set up, and so. Basically, long story short, the sound did not record, and so I was basically talking to myself for a good 15 minutes. That's kind of awkward, but, you know, you gotta shake it off and move on. <laughs> so, I gotta go through and redo all of this. <sighs> okay, so, um, it seemed like everybody wanted me to give them a makeover because they were pretty, um like just atrocious looking so that's what I did I went through and I gave each one a makeover this is Ileana and I gave her this top from Supernatural and I put some red in it and red lipstick and got rid of the scary blush and uh, she's standing in a chair that's that's great that's that's awesome but um yeah so I gave her this new look because she is a daredevil and so I wanted her to give her a little hint of red because I feel like that's what daredevils wear <laughs> but oh, wow she's actually talking to her son that's great step in the right direction complain about Parker being slobby yeah that will build your relationship all right so next I can show you Parker this is Parker he looks like a lot different but um He's actually pretty good looking if he's not making this like sad face. Mm, okay. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, he's pretty like adorable. And I never realized how like I do not have that much stuff for boy teen create a sim. Like, wow, I like seriously, there's not many choices for what I could put on him. So yeah, he just has some base game shorts and shoes and a jersey, and I think he looks okay. And we can look at Zelda May, which right now she's in her workout outfit because off camera while I was talking to myself, um, she started flirting with Dustin and then she he's really high in the athletic skills. So she started asking him to train her. And so they went on the treadmill and he like shouted at her while she ran. Yeah. Um, let me get her to stand up and... Um, change her outfit let's see oh god this is all so overwhelming okay outfit i mean, want her in her every day okay i didn't also i didn't change any of their other outfits like i just changed her every day and their hair i also didn't i didn't change any facial features because that's like making them a different sim and that's not cool i also tried to stick with also the theme of how they were dressed so she's wearing orange because a those atrocious orange shorts that she was wearing. Well, I don't know what her favorite color is, but, um, what am I doing? Pink, but, yeah, so. I put her in a orange dress, and it's, this is custom content. It's super cute. And then some base game sandals. Um, yeah, so basically she already started flirting with Dustin. I didn't even tell her to, and then she got on the treadmill and was all like, hey, you want to teach me how to work out? Like, Come on, slut. You know what you're doing. Look at that face. Look at it. She knows good and well what she is doing. I put on some dramatic, like, cat eye eyeliner, and I think it looks cool on her, so I'm going to keep it. Um, speaking of sticking with the theme of how they were dressed before, wow. Girl, you <laughs> render. That was kind of scary. Um, but this is Kaylin, and this is the one that was a maid, and she was wearing a black and white dress before because she was a, um, she's a maid, and, like, she wears this black and white getup in The Sims too. so I kept her in black and white, and I gave her, like, a little shirt and black pants, and I really love this hair. I don't even know where it's from, but I love it, like, to the max. It's cute. So cute. Okay. And then next we have Dustin, who she's playing football with. He's also in his athletic clothes because, like I said, he was um, he was helping Zelda work out, which, yeah, it was just really awkward all around. But now he's in his everyday, and here you go. I put him in, like, a vest, and 
he thinks he's so cool, but I, in shorts and yeah, uh, I didn't like, I wasn't going for making these Sims like the prettiest Sims I've ever made. I literally, like I wanted to stay with the theme of who, the theme, like I don't know if Sims can have a theme, but like I wanted to stay with who they are and I wanted to kind of stay with what they were wearing before, but make it better. Oops. Sorry me. about that. My phone was all ring a ringing but yeah, I don't remember what I was saying before, but that's whatever. I think I was saying how I tried to dress them similar, not really like that similar because they were wearing some really hideous stuff before, but I tried to dress them logically like how, I don't know. I didn't just like go out and completely change who they are as a sim, so yeah, I hope you guys like their makeovers, and I guess we will just jump right into playing them. Um, I will also renovate the house. They don't have that much money, so it's not going to be anything drastic, and I'm not going to, like, like, again, with how I did with their makeovers, I'm not going to change, like, what the house is. Like, I'm just going to kind of update it and add some things and stuff like that, but that will be at the end before we leave them, which... I don't know how long, like, I want to play with each family because I want to see where they go in life, but I, then again, I don't want it to drag on or anything. Oh my gosh, she's playing video games, really? Really? Alright, somebody needs to cook dinner. Um, this guy, I was off while well, I was trying to film, but the sound wasn't picking up, but this, I don't know what happened to them, but, um, ugh, this is what happens when you drink soda, but, <laughs> Okay, this guy, Jack Bunch, called and was like, can I bring my kids over? Like, who does that? Hey, can my kids come over? And he did, and he, like, brought his kids over, but I guess they're already gone. And, yeah, it looks like he got a new job. The same guy I'm talking about right now, Jack Bunch. Yeah, he got a new job. All right, what's up here? Is this, oh, this is their master. That's neat, 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 neat. Alright, someone needs to cook dinner, and I pick you because I hate you, kind of, Ileana. <laughs> Alright, make some dinner, serve some mac and cheese. Wonderful. Wonderful. We should probably set the bed ownership. This is... Zelda's. This is Ileana. And... Dustin... This is going to be Kaylin. Yas. And this is going to be, what's his name? Parker. Parker. Okay. If someone's going to grab food, I'm going to be mad because she's definitely cooking right there. I hate when Sims do that. Like, they can clearly see that someone is cooking dinner and then they go and grab, like, a piece of freaking cake out the fridge. I've pretty, I'm pretty, blah, 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 blah. I'm pretty sure I've done that five million times to my own mother, but yeah, it bugs me. <laughs> Sprite is good, people. Ah, <sighs> okay. What is everybody doing? They're just like congregating. Uh oh. We're sharing secrets with each other, and Caitlin disappeared, and she's unroutable. Girl, you having some issues? Learn how to route yourself. <laughs> They should get a pet or something, I feel like. That would be neat. She wants to become an illustrious author, master the writing and painting skill. Okay. <laughs> we'll let you do that. We probably will not be, um, we won't be sticking around long enough to max their lifetime wishes, but I want you to know. see your face. She looks just pissed, like she hates her life and her family. Alright, call everyone to the meal. I don't even think there's enough room at their table to eat, but... Yeah. First four to get here, get food. I really like when my sims eat as a family. Alright. Okay, 
Is Kaylin coming? What are you doing? You're painting. Can you go eat dinner? She's so just indifferent, like, with her family. Jack Bunch would like to chat. Does Dustin want to talk? Sure, that's cool. We're going to have Zelda actually hit on Dustin right now. Okay, compliment his appearance. I think that Dustin should have a baby with Zelda. That'd be too, too funny. Actually, they need to go in her room and do this away from, like, the kids, so... Um, please go here. And then you're going to call Dustin over. Not Parker. Is he following? Oh, my God. What? Oh, my God, Parker. You're so creepy. Look at him. Can he? What is this? What is this? Bro. Can you leave? Get out, please. Okay. That's just too creepy. Wrong. Wrong, Landrac followed. Okay, you get out, and you get off the phone, and go here, and you go here. I'm trying to cause some drama, and you people are getting in the way. All right. Just sit here and wait wait for her. Alright, now you are going to lay the moves onto him. He's not going to do them with you because look at her bikini. It's the fire print. Mm. This girl. Mmm. Up to no good. Alright, and then now you're going to compliment his personality. And you're going to heat of the moment, kiss him. She's feeling, she's feeling the... Can you feel the love tonight? Oh, snap, people. Oh, God. Oh, God. Can you feel the love tonight? <laughs> okay. All right. Let me just get a good picture of this. Yes. His mouth is completely over her face. Wow. Now, this is real awkward. This just got real. Does the family know? Is this, do they know? All right. You need to leave this situation. The macaroni made you guys a little, a little high on life. What did Eliana put in that macaroni? She's in bed. She doesn't even care. All the kids need to go to bed because they have school in the morning. So, sleep. You also need to sleep. Where are you? Dude, this is not your room. Can you leave? Ugh. Why can't she sleep here? Sleep in Kaylin's bed? This... What? This is... You are Kaylin. You are Kaylin. <laughs> this is the weirdest child I've ever seen. Speaks in third person and everything. Zelda, go. All right. Why is her bedroom the only one down here? Okay, I'm going to fast forward till the morning, and hopefully the lag gets a bit better. Okay, so I will see you guys then. Everyone's starting to wake up now, and it looks like Parker and Ileana are starting to, like, get to know each other. Like, they keep talking to each other, and I'm not doing anything. So that's really good. Parker's, he's complimenting her. She's probably going to be a bitch and be like, no! But, um... 
See, that's nice. I like to see mother and son interaction. She's going to work in. He needs to go to school. He already showered. Somebody forgot to clean up the macaroni. So you can do that. And have some cereal. Zelda, you are up. I don't know what I'm going to do with you. You're so crazy. Look, they just went like tacky crazy. Like, look at this. I swear. But... Honestly, I like it, and I would like to see this in The Sims 4 because Sims have more personality in Sunset Valley than I think they do a lot of the other towns. So, it just, they have better stories and junk like that. She's going to work. You need to meet your co-work, no, power work, because you are a crazy workaholic. Hello, Cyclone. I want to know his story. What's his story? We'll, we'll play him later. Um, okay. He's up. Oh, he's talking to Caitlyn. I don't know how to handle this situation with Zelda. It's kind of awkward. Like, should he leave his wife? Or should he stay and try to figure this out? That's the question of the year. And apparently Zelda's obsessed with playing with children's toys. And she needs to grow up and find a job. What does she go to work? Eight hours. Okay. Well, you're good for nothing. You can go use. You need to find your own man that's not married, Zelda. And you need to move out and you need to live with him. Because you are not wanted. Well, yeah. I don't want you here. You're screwing up this family. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'm just going to speed through their day until something cool happens okay guys so everyone left Ileana's at work and the kids are at school so it is just Dustin and Zelda at the house right now which yeah it's a little awkward like should they talk about what happened go um go talk about gardening because she really likes guarding, gardening, so we want to start off the conversation light. <laughs> we don't want to talk about the deep stuff right off the bat. She's so cute. Okay. Now, we're going to have him kiss her, and then they're going to... Risky woohoo. Uh, you guys are probably going to hate me for this, but yeah. <laughs> Snap, girl. This is so wrong in so many levels. <laughs> oh, I can't. I can't. This is so wrong. <laughs> are they going to do it? Oh, uh, it's risky. Uh, if you guys didn't know that the risky woohoo -woo comes with the NRAS woohoo -woo mod, and basically it just gives you an extra option, and it's like a 10% chance to get pregnant, and it doesn't do the baby ring when you get pregnant. So you don't know unless you, you know, you look at the phone and look at the university option. The like, that awkward moment when your mother walks in the room when your Sims are about to woohoo. <laughs> but, um, anyways. Um, I forgot. I was talking about the Wooer mod, but yeah, most of the time I don't cheat because it's it's fun to be surprised. What's wrong? Continue cooking. It's fun to be surprised um, <laughs> when they like get their baby bump or whatever, and you didn't know if they were pregnant or not. So I guess we will just have to not know <laughs> if she is pregnant. And she has been drinking. She was drinking at the juice bar, but he has not, so he is fully aware what is wrong with this. He fully understands. Oh my, she is cheering on a storm. Okay. Wow. Okay, so he's going to cook lunch for them, and she's going to continue drinking because she just did something very evil to her sister. <laughs> Oh gosh, this is such a this is such a handful of a situation here. God, I want to check so bad, guys. I want to check, but that's no. It takes away the excitement. We will just have to wonder: Is she pregnant? 
Okay, he's cooking waffles for the two of them. And she's just drinking. All right, you come eat some waffles. Why does he need to be a stay-at-home dad when his kids, like, aren't even home during the day? That doesn't make any sense to me. <sighs> like, none whatsoever. Okay. A fishy science project for Parker Landrag. The science facility has partnered with the school to conduct the fishing project. However, they are running low on the fish for the experiment. You've been asked to bring a fish to the science facility before the experiment begins. Your school performance will increase as a reward. Cool. Eh. Okay, I keep clicking and going to the school. I know where they're at. Okay, we're gonna go back home with these two. I hope they act normal when everyone else gets home. Cause that's gonna be weird if they, you know, continue on with their little affair in front of the children. That's just not okay. He's stroffing his face. All right, let's clean up. I know you're a slob, but you need to clean. And we'll put this in the fridge for others when they get home. And he needs, I just feel like he's so pointless. Like he doesn't even have a job. Should I get him a job? No. No. You need to go play your guitar peacefully and think about what you have done. Guys, I want to check. Oh, because that's going to be really bad if she's pregnant. Like, I can't believe I just did that. Parker's class will be taking a field trip tomorrow to the land grab industries science facility. Do you want to sign the permission slip for him to attend? Yeah, sure. Why not? Is she any good? Let's hear. Yeah, she's pretty good. All right. He can go out here and swimmy swim. And I think her carpool is here. Yeah, it's here. Oops. My bad. Go to work. Oh, I didn't know she had all these plants in her inventory that she can totally plant. I am all over the place. That's nice. Okay. He can swim. I don't even know what he wants out of life. He wants to work out and do nothing. Basically. Basically. Every man's dream to work out and do nothing. <laughs> Maybe not every man. Okay. OP brought a friend, Ethan Bunch. Apparently, I think they're really, this family is really close with um, Ethan. He wants to prank the school. Yeah, you turn into a little badass, aren't you, Parker? Oh, they're doing their homework. First thing when they get home. That is so great. I didn't even have to tell you to do that. Thanks. And Ileana's coming home. Wow. What an awkward situation this is. I want to check. Gosh. Okay. Must refrain. Um, where's the little one? She's still coming home. You can get out and probably need to cook some dinner later. Later. Oh, you know how to make pumpkin pie? That's quite cool. But it's summer. I feel like it's not seasonal for that. You can come upstairs and work out. And you? What can you do? What do you want? She wants to text Iqbal, okay? Which I think that's your boss. Yeah. Text him. That's doable. It's kind of pointless doing their lifetime wishes because we're not like going to play with them in the long run. But, you know kind of gives you direction. She wants to clean a toilet, so that's... I, I've never met anyone who wants to clean a toilet, but by all means, go ahead, Eliana. Go right ahead. There's none to be cleaned. Oh. Okay, well. Just watch TV and talk to your kids. Where are you at? You need to do your homework as well. Do your homework! And he's working out. Alright. Look at that bobo run. Oh, look at cat. No, that's a raccoon, isn't it? I'm gonna have him go find them a dog 
in just a minute, wherever the newspaper's at. He's going to check the neighborhood for pets to adopt because they need a dog or something. I feel like Ileana would be extremely opposed to that, but, you know. Oh my gosh, their bills are high. Not cool. Actually, I'm going to have you, Ileana, can pay the bills. Come do that. Okay. Now you need to go fishing. This is where the bunches live. Okay. Where can we go fishing? Is there a pond here? No. Go here with your friend. And you can fish there. I'm glad the lag got better. It's just, I guess, when you make a new save file, it's kind of an issue. But I think we're all good. I say that now and then it'll something it'll probably like crash or something on me. But okay, you need a desk, my love. You're working indefinitely. Work two hours or work indefinitely. You should just work for two hours. And where are you at? You're working out. You want to get fatigued, so we'll let you keep going. And where's Zelda? She's she needs to meet her fellow musicians. And then where's Parker? Okay, he's fishing. He just needs one fish, I'm pretty sure. So. Oh, he caught one. Go deliver your fish. Probably leave your friend behind, but, you know. You'll probably get also paid for doing this fishing thing. Go, go, go. Okay. Did his, his friend, like, we were literally just with him, and apparently he's hooking up with someone named Holly Alto. Like, did we really? In the five minutes we've been gone, bro, you got a girlfriend. Are you for cereal? Let's look. Where, where is he? Are you for cereal? That doesn't even make sense. Where did he go? He ran away with that girl. Mm-hmm. How rude. Anyways. He could have fished back here. Look at this. You could fish for all kinds of crap back here. I never noticed that before. That's cool. I like that. Okay, so he got, like, monies for that. I'm not sure how much. The specimen was excellent and had just the right number of scales in your... The fishiest eyes you've ever seen. Your school performance has increased. Great. So go home. Oh, I never knew this fountain was like a bench. God, I'm like, I don't understand. Like, I'm learning so many things. It's so weird. Okay, what is everyone doing back home? Please don't be causing trouble. There's no pets to adopt. All right. So maybe we'll just get one from the shelter. Somebody got promoted. It's Zelda. Okay. I guess we'll just adopt one from the shelter. Should they get a dog or cat? I'm thinking a dog. But maybe that's just me because I like dogs way better than cats. I think their house is pretty cute. Alright, so this is what we have to choose from. Um... Some of these dogs look a little crazy. This one's kind of cute. Ben-Ben, but I might have to change that name because that's like... Ben-Ben, really? Ben-Ben. Ben-Ben. Um. Um. Ben-Ben. He's genius, but also clueless, which makes no sense at all to me. And lazy. I think we're going to go with little Ben-Ben. Uh, we'll just name him Ben. Just one Ben is good enough. Just one. <laughs> just Ben. I feel like that's still a really strange name for a dog. I guess I'm just not that good at naming dogs. 
All right. Nobody cooked dinner. These poor kids are probably starving. Probably not. Who cares? But it's too late for that anyways. And come. You need to come shower. And then... Use hooking up is easy. Saying that way is a tough part. Ethan, Bunch, and Holly all toes seem willing to try, though. They've decided to go steady. I was about to say they are, I thought I was about to say that they already broke up. I was like, dang, world's shortest relationship. All right, stop. I'll give you your own toy box if you will stop. Oh my god, I'm about to buy this chick a toy box, like seriously, because she will not stop. <laughs> okay, we're gonna buy her. this one because she's freaking obsessed and we're just gonna yes will that make you happy zelda will that make you happy Ugh. all right god i want to know so bad if she's prego but yeah i guess we'll never know no stop play with your own toy box Come down and play with your own toy box. You're so immature. If this was my little sister, I'm pretty sure I would get really freaking annoyed. No, is she going to play with the toy box? My Scooby! Oh, she hates the toy box. You're a kid, though. You should like it. Ugh, okay. I will never understand. You can go play dolls and then... Oh, crap, no. Go to bed. It's past your bedtime. You should check for monsters, though, because, yeah... You never know, girl. Monsters, Inc. Mike Wazowski could be under there. It's gonna get you in your sleep. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, snap. Did that just happen? What? That was- that creeped me out. I wouldn't sleep there. Oh, God. Are you kidding? Caitlin Landrack isn't going anywhere near that bed. Well, where are you gonna sleep? That makes no sense. I don't have any other beds for you. You can sleep with Zelda, I guess. Oh my god. She really... She's playing with toys. Okay. Woo. Woo. Alright. Go to sleep. She's asking her big bro to make... Read her a bedtime story. That's too cute. Dude, she's down here. You're looking... You're looking like right above her head. I hate when people do that to me. I'm short too. And people look over my head. That makes me mad. Alright. You are asleep. You are reading. You can come clean up this crap. You need to clean the house. I don't know where you are. There you No. That's not you. Oh. So yeah. She's going to sleep with Zelda. Okay. Oh, this is too cute. He's reading to her. Too cute. That's That was a short story. Are you done? You're done? Alright, whatever. You go to sleep. You go eat some ice cream or something extremely unhealthy like that. And then you can also go a nighty night night. Okay. So, I think this is where I'm going to end this part, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you would like to see more, and leave any suggestions or comments down below. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys!